Hey everyone, it's Megan with the Crosstown Auto Center. Today I'm going to take you for a walk around this 2013 Ram 1500 Sport 4x4. This is accident free and car proof verified. Painted in a nice bright silver metallic clear coat. Under that hood you're going to find a 5.7 liter V8 Hemi and that's paired with a 6 speed automatic transmission. We've got that performance hood, that body colored grill, projection style headlamps, daytime running lights, and then the fog lights down at the bottom there. Your Ram 1500 is riding on 20 inch aluminum wheels, wrapped in a Goodyear tire. Those are nitrogen filled. All right guys, I've showed you a little bit of the outside of this Ram 1500. If you wanna follow me inside, I'll show you a bit more. All right, and giving us a hand into our Ram 1500 is the remote keyless entry system with that proximity key. And on that key fob, you're going to find the lock button, that unlock button, and the panic button. So that proximity key means you don't have to have the key in your hand to lock and unlock the door. So away in your pocket, your purse, your bag, whatever the case is, push that little black button, it'll lock up for you. And then just putting your hand through the handle will open it. So we're coming inside to some dark black interior. We've got soft touch surfaces on the side of the driver's door here. Some nice white stitching, contrast stitching. We've got those power options, locks, windows, and mirrors on the side as well couple different storage compartments on the side of the door along with those beverage holders. Coming inside to the automatic headlights, set it and forget it. Adjustable drivers, or excuse me, adjustable pedals and steering column there. Nice leather interior, again with that nice white sport stitching tying that look in nicely. We've got the driver, the power adjustable driver seat. All right, jump in and get it started for you. All right, so your Ram 1500 Sport is a push to start. So you're just gonna want to press the brake. Push that start button and it'll start right up for you. So having a look at that vehicle information center, you can see that the 1500 has 50,609 kilometers on it. We're currently facing northeast, and it is a chilly minus 10 degrees in the city of Edmonton. So over on the left-hand side, um, this is a completely customizable information center. So just navigating through some of these options here, we've got our trip information, fuel economy, um, your tire pressure monitoring system, your speedometer. So this is your digital speedometer. And you can change that again to read kilometers or miles, whichever whichever you'd prefer. We've got that screen set up as I was telling you about, any stored messages, your um, audio information there. So I was using the buttons located on the left-hand side of your heated leather wrap steering wheel. All right, so just these buttons down here. The top buttons are for your voice recognition and Bluetooth. Panning over to our right-hand side, we've got those buttons for your cruise control setting. Conveniently mounted to the back of our steering wheel, We've got the audio controls. So you can control the volume of the radio without taking your hands off the steering wheel, which is a great safety feature to have. You can change the station as well with the controls that are mounted on the other side of the steering wheel. All right, so having a look at that vehicle information center, we are currently on the radio menu. So this is where you're gonna find your AM, your FM, and your satellite radio. We've got your media, any, any connected devices that you have, um, iPhones or your mobile device, your control center here, which will control your heated seats. All right, and your, ven your ventilated seat as well. Um, and if I hadn't already mentioned that heated steering wheel, both of those features are great to have in this freezing cold weather that we've been having. Um, we've got the climate controls there, your navigation, your phone connectivity, and those settings. Definitely recommend coming in and going through all of those. We've got the manual controls for your radio, the um, climate as well. Just below that, those manual controls for your heated and ventilated seating as long, um, excuse me, 
uh, as well as that steering wheel. Just below that we have some storage area and those mats come out for easy cleaning. In the center um, a couple of beverage holders, another storage compartment and a 12 volt power outlet. So we've got this armrest slash center console here, two tiered. So the top offers some shallow storage with your USB auxiliary and the SD card input. And then underneath that is some more deeper storage. Again, that mat down there comes out for easier cleaning. Interior is very well maintained, very clean. Oh, and I think I forgot to show you your tilt and slide sunroof. Get the control for it there. All right, guys, so I think I have shown you enough of the front. If you want to follow me to the back, I'll show you a bit more. All right, coming into the back seat of that Ram 1500 Sport, again with those premium dark colors in the interior that white sport stitching we have some more soft soft surfaces on the drivers or excuse me the passenger the back passenger door in the back we've got the two map holders on the back of the driver and passenger seat we have two storage compartments on either side All right those bins come out for easy cleaning you can put um, first aid kits cleaners anything in there and then just stow it away. So again, that premium leather interior throughout the back seat as well, very clean. Offers three seats, or you can put that center piece down and, and uh, seat two. So these seats fold up, and it's a 60-40 split. And then just under there, you're gonna find some more storage. You can put stuff in there, stow it away. Got that courtesy light on the bottom of the seat. Out of sight, out of mind. There's four park sensors on the back. I also forgot to show you that backup camera right there. So it is equipped with a backup camera as well. We've got those dual exhaust pipes on the back. Seven and four pin wiring harness connectivity. All right, guys, so I just want to say thanks for taking the time to um, walk around this 2013 Ram 1500 Sport 4x4 with me today. To book that test drive, you can call or click. We're on the corner of 156th Street and the Yellowhead Trail. Hope to see you soon.